it is another day another food review we got the we got the bag we got the arby's the one and only arby's we got the jamocha shake you never know you can't you never you can go wrong with the jamocha shake you guys you guys better be ready for this we got the special number one crispy chicken sandwich i haven't had this one before i'm being completely honest with you but I went there and I'm like, the two for six menu, it's usually like mac and cheese, roast beef, and like some like chicken nuggets. And they changed it. Chick two chicken sandwiches and not even a classic roast beef and cheddar. Just a classic roast beef. That kind of hurt my feelings. I was hyped. I was going to do a food review on the mac and cheese and that. But you know what? Everything happens for a reason. God may have wanted me to do this, so that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. So, looks good. Let's see. Let's see. We're going we're gonna to do this one first. I mean, it's got the lettuce. It's got the mayo. Oh, this is a fish. Fish is good for you, I think. So, yeah, we're going to do a... I'm going to give you guys an honest review out of 15. 10 is kind of plain. We're going to do reviews out of 15 because I feel like that that's just my thing. So, I got some... I got the crispy fish with the spicy... Triple spicy pepper sauce. And you know you can't go wrong with the Jamaica shake. So, I'm going to get this some sauce. Comment down below. Do you guys like to... Like, put it on the sandwich, or you guys like to dip? I'm more of a dipper. I'm a dipper. I like to drip. You know what I'm saying? I like the drip drip. So, yeah. I'm just excited. Today's a snow day. We're supposed to do virtual school. I really didn't do it. You know, you know me. I got priorities. Like, sleep. So, I slept in real late. Which is kind of silly. Kind of kind of useless. But, life goes on. That's one thing that happens in this world. Life's going to go on with or without me. So, I might as well get used to it. See, I'm gonna give you guys an honest review. This thing's like sticking out. Like, okay, here we go. I kind of got it on the dip. Give you guys a little two bite. You gotta get two bite. The first bite, I'm like, yeah, I, it's kind of this. But the, the second bite, when you get to that second bite, man. Whew. that much flavor I think because I just cut the fish I'm gonna give you guys an accurate review everything's gonna be accurate in this world yeah out of breath we're eating this damn sandwich to give you guys an accurate review mmm ah! that ain't bad it's just a fish. There's not much taste. I'm really just only tasting the sauce. And the sauce reminds me of like a roast beef slider or something like that. To be honest with you, I'm feeling like a like a 9.34. 9.34 for the crispy fish sandwich. I mean, it's good, but it just doesn't have that kick to it. You know, I need that kick to something. That's the way I look at it. It just doesn't have that... That nothing to make me like, ah, oh, I'm gonna go to Arby's and get this. It's just like something you just get there. So I'll give it a 9.34. Ain't bad. I'll get one more bite. One more bite. I mean, it's good. It's kind of healthy. It looks pretty good. It makes me feel pretty good. It ain't bad. It's got tomatoes, lettuce, onions, not onions, it's got it all. So it's got the package, but it's just, it's not it for me. I mean, it's decent, but it's not something I'm going to go nuts about. It's not, I mean, like, if you're hungry and you're buying Arby's and you want something to eat, you might as well give it a try. So we're going to move on to the Jamocha Shake. We'll do the we'll do the roast beef slider last, because I've already had them. Jamocha Shakes, I've used, these is like my childhood. I lived off these. And they're pretty decent, but they're getting old, kind of, but... I, I can't go to Arby's and I can't jump up a shake because I'm doing a food review. So, give you guys an honest review out of 15, and here we go. Pretty good. Not going to lie to you. 
they don't they don't get old. There's such a mocha taste. Like I'm about to go into the YMCA and it's gonna give me that kick. I'm gonna go play basketball. I mean, when you freaking look outside, there's like no one even here. I'm like the only car. What's how many cars? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The ninth car here besides the workers. And probably some of those other workers. So that means like no one's here and I'm just about that work. God damn. Okay, here we go. But yeah, let me give you more chase. Ain't bad, but not many people don't know about this. You got the whipped cream, so here's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to get it. You're supposed to give it a little mixy rooey. A mix of roux. Once you get it mixed in there, it's good. Yeah, got to get that good, good. That good, 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 good. You can't go wrong. I'm going to give this Arby's Shakes. I'm going to ice just hold my... I'm going to give this Arby's Jamocha Shake. Size medium. I'm going to give it a 13.61. 13.61. I mean... Damn, I'd be eating it gets me out of breath. Eating and talking is... That's a skill if you can do it. So yeah, I would say the Arby's... Let me still go one more thing. It's just like... It's the classic roast beef. You can't go wrong with this. I'm noticing as like time's going on, everything's getting smaller. Everything's getting more and more expensive. There's inflation right now, man. Biden, I'm getting sick of it. Get Biden out of there. So yeah, here we go. We're gonna, we're gonna try the classic roast beef. I mean, it's pretty good. It's got the... Kind of hard to show you guys. This is kind of a weak one, to be honest with you. Not as good as I thought. Didn't live up to my expectations. Based on the visual look. But we're going to get the physical. We're going to get the physical. We're going to get the taste. We need to taste it. Because we're going to go around the world and we're going to do some food reviews. Because I have a vision. There might be people right now that are filming TikToks at my school that are getting more views. Getting this, yada, yada, yada. But they're not as going to be as consistent consistent as me. And I'm, I have a real meaning. Some they have, I mean, they have a meaning, but... I'm gonna keep pushing through. It's kinda be it's gonna be hard to stop me once once I keep going through. And people are gonna be they're gonna support me in the beginning. And once I get to the top, they're gonna be like, man, they're gonna start talking bad, they're gonna do this, but you know what? It's gonna be okay. I, I don't wanna make these food reviews negative. I wanna spot speak all on positive stuff, so that's what I'm gonna do. But yeah, I'm getting my spicy spicy three pepper sauce. Cause I I'm gonna let's rate the spicy three pepper sauce. I would give it a Very tangy and very strong, I'll tell you that. But to be honest with you, the sauce has got to be like, by itself, I'll give it an 8 out of 12. But like, with the stuff, it just adds like, when you taste the sandwich without the sauce, the sandwich is like a 2 out of 15. But with the sauce, it's like, about to find out. We'll give it a little dip action. Here we go. Look like a joker. You never know the true thing until you get to the second bite. I'll go for the second bite. I'll give it a 9.9 .9 out of 15 i mean i've had it so much it's like it's just plain really i'm used to the cheddar the cheddar made it but i eat like a freaking animal sometimes especially when i record myself the cheddar just wasn't there and it just it was decent but let me get one more bite it wasn't nothing to go nuts about But yeah, moving on. Let's go to the next. So yeah, it's pretty good. I'm 
I'd say overall for what did I spend? I spent ten sixty six. Spent ten sixty six. I got a one roast beef classic, one spicy sandwich, one medium jumbo shake, and a cup of water. I got the two for six, the two sandwiches and the thing. So it was like six plus four and then tax. So like it's like eleven bucks almost with tax. But yeah, I mean, for eleven bucks, if you really think about it, I could have went to Chipotle. I could have went to Cane's, but like it's snowing out, and I figured why not do an Arby's review? I like to, I drive by there a lot. I go there a lot with my dad, so I figured crank it out at Arby's review. So I'm about to eat this food down. I'm about to go to the Y, and I'm gonna have a good time because. That's what life's about. Life's about doing the right thing and trying to have something to show for in this world. I mean, I kind of look like a bum right now. I didn't really have time to get ready. I just got out. I'm like, screw it. Let's go to the Y. So I do an Arby's review. But Arby's, I mean, they're not horrible, but they're just, they're not the best. They're not somebody to go nuts. But White Castle and freaking, what's the other place? White Castle's pretty good. And uh, what's that other place that's underrated? White Castle and Wendy's. Okay, we're gonna do we're gonna do like the whole menu there. So, knocked off a couple things on the menu, but to end this video off, I just want to say, do something with your day, even if that's making a TikTok, even if that's holding the door for someone, even if that's calling your grandma, even if that's calling your talking to your mom or dad. Just do something for someone. No act of kindness is gonna go unnoticed. No act of kindness is gonna go is gonna. It's in the end, an act of positivity or act of kindness is always the way to go because someone's always someone's always going through something in this world and i tell you guys all these negative things that happen to me so you can see to push through it i don't want no one to have sympathy sympathy for me i have i'm blessed to have this mindset i'm blessed to be where i'm at financially physically mentally spiritually and i'm just proud of myself and in this video off i just want to say stay positive and do something with your day don't let these days keep going by i remember like yesterday it was freaking october and now it's february 2022 life's gonna keep going you got to look around and you got to appreciate stuff. You got to implement habits every day that are so simple that you're just going to keep doing them. At the end, end of 5, 10, 100 years, you're going to be so strong, beautiful, mentally, physically, emotionally. You're going to be this great person and become the best version of yourself. So to end this video off, man, just do something today. Do something great with your day. I would, that's all I would have to say in this world is do something great with your day. You got one opportunity in this world. 